My name's Eric Young. I got a service side. I got a service front air brake chamber. And I have a rear spring brake chamber here with service side application also. A R14 relay valve and an R12 relay valve to actuate the service brake. R14 will actuate the emergency brake or parking. Also, at the same time, I'll be, I'll be showing you how the anti compounder feature from the R14 that's delivered from the R14 valve uh, actuates one brake one brake chamber and not the other. It keeps both of them from actuating at the same time. First, we're going to apply our service brake. As you can see, both rods screwed out. Well, you got a little pop here. Both rods screwed out. Now this whole thing is on 100 PSI pressure. To demonstrate the anti-compounding feature of the emergency brake, we don't have the case, so you really can't tell, but as you look in there, when I push shop air in here, the uh, the, the rod here will uh, retract in, pushing the, recompressing the spring inside of the, uh, inside of the emergency brake side. As you can see, that's where you would put your, anti your uh, key to, uh, your key to case the brake chamber. And there it is. Thank you.